the thought that I wanted to give you guys um, to help as we um, give during this time is a continuation of my thought that I gave the last time when we were together. It feels like forever ago. But if you'll remember, I started um, with a thought from 2 Corinthians chapter 9. So I wanted to continue my thought there. Um, you know, feel free to read that chapter um, as it re relates to giving. And the thing that I wanted to bring out or point out was that as we give, we don't want to confuse God's um, care and providence as we give uh, with the gospel of wealth that some, you know, talk about or preach about. And just one explanation of how that's different, I heard uh, from a talk on uh, Bible Talk TV, and he had a, a great point on how that this is different. Because if I give to get something you know, back, to get something back, then is it really giving anymore? At that point, you know, if I'm just giving to get, then it's no longer giving. It's mm, something else like um, trading or bargaining. Um, and if you think about it that way, it kind of helps that, you know, when I give, I need to make sure that my heart is right and I'm giving for the right reason and um, not hoping to, you know, bargain or trade with God because that's that's not what we want to do. We want to give um, cheerfully and out of love. So as as we give, you know, today or throughout the week, um, make sure to to be giving um, out of love. Let us pray. Father, thank you so much for all the ways you bless us. Um, I pray that as we give, we wouldn't um, give with the wrong motives, but that we would be uh, willing givers, give cheerfully and out of love. We thank you that you take care of us and that you love us and that you know what we need even before we ask it. We ask this prayer in Jesus' name. Amen.